Welcome to Cars 2012 Performance Shootout. The car team are here today at the beautiful Hayes Pass, just outside Oatsern. And we've got two cars which are perfect for a blast up a mountain pass. We've got the Audi RS3 and the BMW 1 M2K. I am, um, when I was like 25, we were racing BMW 3 to 5 ISs with Tony Viana and Peter Lance and Jeff Gordon and so on. This car is uncanny how much it feels like that group end car. It's, it's so easy for me to drive. It's just like I'm going back 20 years and I'm just, it's just amazing. I, I can't believe they can make a car like this. It's really, it's fantastic. I, 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 the balance of it, everything, um, I'm, I'm blown away. It's really a great car. Uh, <laughs> driving this here at Carl Army now, it's, it's, it's really amazing. <laughs> it's like a kid. Tony Bjorn would have loved this car. When you drive a four-wheel drive car, you always, I always go, what a good car. When I drive a rear-wheel drive car, I go, gee, I'm a good driver. Because <laughs> this car is really good. It really just hit all the apexes. It's very fast. It's very forgiving. Um, it just, it's just not as involving as the BMW. It, it may even be faster around the track, I don't know. But, uh, and so it's, it's a superb motor car. It really does everything so well but it just doesn't evoke those same, same emotions. But a couple of years ago, Sean Watson-Smith said to me that um, he would never want to race in a, a, a car other than a, a four-wheel drive car. And I can see why, because lap after lap, you just drive around here, hitting all the apexes, stopping, turning. It's just brilliant, you know, not scared. Uh, it's just a great car, but it doesn't have that same Oomph. emotional involvement for me. 